Um, this is a warning before the video starts. Somewhere through the video, my bird just starts tweeting, and a professional YouTuber would be like, hey, yo, my bird is tweeting. Uh, I shouldn't record right now. But today, I was just like, I'm gonna just record anyways, because if I don't record now, I'm never gonna feel like recording ever again. So, you're just gonna have to deal with that. Also, um, I recorded this like a month ago, so you're gonna see my hair be extremely pink. Uh, it's washed out by now, but don't mind that. One, two, three, four. Hello everybody, my name is Sma and welcome back to my weird channel. Today, I'm going to be playing some Death Road to Canada. Actually, I'm going to be illustrating some Death Road to Canada. So, to basically explain what's happening, um, I enjoy a YouTuber called Lavender Town. If you don't know who she is, she's an art YouTuber who does a lot of character designs based off of just like anything. She'll do character designs, but she also do like challenges and she, I know recently she like showed off her sketchbook. I don't know. She, she does a bunch of cool, fun stuff. There were also a few times that she did videos of her illustrating her BitLife game. And I was like, hmm, I need to make a video this month. And so... I'm gonna do Death Road to Canada. But I was like, how can we make this more interesting? Cause I'm pretty boring. I remember. I remember. I once did a Walking Dead series. And well, that was many years ago. I remember it not being liked as much as my other videos with other people. And recently I haven't really been able to record with anyone. So I'm like, how can I make this more interesting? So we're going to be illustrating some of the things that happen in Death Road to Canada. Now, that's what I'm planning on doing. I'm not sure exactly how this is going to work, but we're just, we're just going to roll with it. We're going to freaking go. I have played this game before. This is not my first time playing Death Road to Canada. However, the last time I played it was two years ago. It was either two or one year ago. I think it was two years ago. I played it. No? Maybe it was a year ago. I don't know. It's been- Do we want a buddy? You know, I don't think- I think we're gonna go nobody. I think we're- We're just gonna go freaking nobody. Forget people. Who needs others? We'll, we'll randomize it three times. Just to like, get a look at who's there. So, that's one. Garth, gun collector. <laughs> it's right irritating. Honestly, I might just go with Garth because he's got such a funky freaking outfit and like such interesting hair that like how could I not pick Garth? I think we're gonna go with Garth and he's a gun collector. Okay, Garth hears rumors that Canada is a safe place free of the threat of zombies. With nothing to gain from waiting around in Florida, he decides to be brave to- Oh, he decides to brave the death road and travel north. Try sacrificing someone you don't like by getting them eaten on purpose. This will distract zombies. Why is that the first thing that they say when you get onto this game? Oh my god, Garth has a ponytail. Okay, so to start the journey, Garth decides to grab some supplies from a nearby location. In order to survive the death, to survive the death road, you'll need to hoard as many supplies as you can. You will also need to find ways to train and grow your team. There's a quiet hotel. <laughs> I'm not sure I can record this right now. You're just gonna have to deal with it. I'm, I'm recording it now. Spots an abandoned Yalmar off a distance. It looks like it's been looted, but maybe there's some untouched loot inside. Swarm size mild aggression sluggish current time morning. Hey, it's voiceover Sam here. Don't know why I introduced myself like that or the, the reason that I felt the need to anyways. But hey, it's voiceover Sam here. Um, so basically, 
for this, I was trying to figure out a way to include the gameplay action and the speed paint. I'm not sure if I did it successfully, but I tried to. Um, I just added like a, a overlay, or I think it's called multiply effect on top of the original clip. I, I put the speed paint on top of the original um, video game clip and I just made it multiply. And then it did this really weird effect I think I like it, but I'm not sure if it's like too annoying to the point of where you can't see what's happening or like it's just annoying in general. Um, but yeah, I basically just did a speed paint of Mr. Garth uh, fighting some zombies in the grocery store with a mop because he had a mop at the beginning of the thing. And I was like, you know, it's going to be hilarious if he started fighting zombies with a mop. Because of all things, you know. But, uh, yeah. There is the Garth. The Garth? The Garth. There is the Garth. He's very cool. Also did some lighting effect, which I just want to add that in. Yeah, very cool. There's Garth. Garth camps out in a pro shop near a golf course. He looks out of the window and sees a large group of zombies approaching him from the driving range. Shoot golf balls at the zombies, prepare for the siege, drive away with no sleep. The zombies start hitting the door on the pro shop. There's not much time to prepare before the door breaks. Siege alert, there's no escape. Horde size very large, current time after dark. Siege length one hour. Which one? Oh god. I can handle this. This is fine. See, look at how good I'm doing already. Everything. Okay, sorry. Um, frick. Everything is perfectly fine. See? No. I. Boom. 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 Boom, boom, oh god, okay, I take everything back, um, wait, can't I switch? Frick, wait, how do I, 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 they're both out? Um, excuse me, siege is over, you can try to escape now, uh, no, wait, it's over, it's over, it's fine, <laughs> okay, 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 I, I thought it was gonna be longer than that, um, frick, take this, take this, take this, take this, uh, 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 get out, get out, get out, get out, you want to leave this location? Yes, let's go. Okay. <laughs> I almost died already. The worst of the zombie siege is over. Garth clears out any remaining zombies outside, then go back in the sh and to, sh to splat on any stragglers so he can set up camp. How'd you get happier? You just like almost died, man. <laughs> Garth just got like. Garth spots an infested city from the road. Scouting it from afar, he's decided whether to fight under noon sun for supplies. Apartment with health banner. Medical clinic. Um, oh shoot. If there's a medical clinic and there's a person in there, I could probably get help. From a person who can like, make me okay. I don't know, I, I don't know why I thought that like, if I'm looking for another person to get help from, I thought that the non-help si banner sign one was the better option. It just didn't, I'm looking back at this and it just didn't process in my brain that th that was like, not the way to go. Voice, vo voice over, hello? Voice over Sam here again. I am here to talk about the speed paint. Um, I took this speed paint in a really weird direction. I originally planned on, like, not doing this. I would say I originally planned on doing, like, a, like, a front view. But, like, I don't really plan on that. It's just, like, this just turned out really weird. Um, when I was sketching for this specific speed paint, I wanted to get, like, a view of the entire bathroom. 
I don't know why, I just did. I wanted to get like a front facing view of the bathroom. And I also thought that it would be hilarious to put a zombie in the shower. Uh, I think it's hilarious. You don't have to think it's hilarious, but I think it's hilarious. Okay, well, I, I don't think it's hilarious. I think it's funny. I, I don't think it's funny. I think it's... My comedy sucks. Um, I also just put like a few extra zombies, like one coming out the window, through the window, as well. With bad, I don't know the lyrics. Um, I'm just kind of rambling at this point. Trying to fill up time because time is. What is time? Is time even existing? Is why are we? Why? Why is this the way that this voiceover went? I'm supposed to be talking about the image. Okay, whether I can say that this like speed paint was successful and that if I liked it and like if I would show this to another human being, um, not really. I I mean it's kind of cool, but like. Some things are just off about it. And also I finished it this morning, like the morning of uploading this, cause I told myself that I was gonna finish it throughout the week and I never just did it. So this morning I had to just do it. Um, I didn't like do it all this morning. I just finished it up this morning, but it, yeah, there it is. It's pretty stupid. I mean, I think it's okay. It's not like terrible, but uh, yeah. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else, so just go, just go, just just go. Go with your car, go with your car, go with your car. Go, go, yes, go! We made it out alive, we are almost dead. Can I use my med kit? Oh! Old man! Old man! You don't want to mess with Garth! Wait, don't fight him. I was about to say don't fight him because you don't have a lot of energy left in you because you're like almost dead, but. Good on you. Hi, I've, oh my, I, it's end of the video. <laughs> oh my, I'm sorry. I'm like so done and I'm ready to finish like editing this video. I'm so like just done with this video. I'm so done with it. Um, but, uh, I, what I have to say about the speed pay. Yes, this is a, the part of the speed pay. There's no gameplay footage because this is, there is no more game. That is it. The man got beaten up by the old guy. So I decided to draw that. And that's how I'm ending the videos with the speed paint. Um, I really like the shading I did for the old man and his beard. I loved doing that. And as for the other guy, he's there uh you know he's he's there um i try to make his face like a little deformed so that he, you know he's getting punched in the face you're you're i, I was trying to make like a ooh funny moment ah, ha ha i look at him get punched in the face his face is deformed now but like i i think i went a little overboard to the point of like unrecognizably like not a human um just a little bit, maybe. Also, I think his ponytail is unproportionate to the to what I've been making it to other drawings. So have that little detail. Now you're gonna be angry that I made his ponytail not long enough. Hmm? Yep. Okay. As uh, as for other, what? Why do I keep saying as for? The car. The car. What I'm doing now is the car. I don't draw cars very often. In fact, I hate drawing cars. I hate drawing mechanical things because they work with for a reason and you have to like know it or else you really can't draw it and i cannot draw cars it looks so deformed and the the tires can we talk about the tires why do the tires look like they are not sitting on the floor ah! <laughs> why am i getting angry okay anyways um yeah that was like the speed paint it was not fun i'm just kidding uh i had fun with this video i think it was pretty fun but uh yeah i'm gonna go now see you <laughs> bye hi hi hello congrats congr